I was really involved a year before because we had this meeting with Stephen Sparrier and we were kind of cooking up this, this idea and we were trying to work out how would it work, how would the panels work, would we have regional specialists or would we have general judges. No one had any idea that it would become the massive and successful thing that it's become. We were quite a small bunch. We had one Italy table at that time. I was the regional chair but I was really the national chair for, for Italy. Stephen Spuria, he always just arrived on his bicycle with his impeccable blue blazer, his pressed trousers with bicycle clips on, uh, and he was a real gentleman and a, a great palate. My earliest memories actually were having terrific fun with a guy called Matthew Stubbs, a master of wine, getting through all the Languedoc Roussillon wines, discovering all these wonderful, exciting wines hidden away in the flights, really enjoying ourselves enormously, and the enjoyments never stopped. I think the reason that's so prestigious is really the quality of the people on the panels. A lot of people have really intimate knowledge of the region and the producers and the vintages. Real subject matter expertise from uh, Europe, from North America, from Australasia. People think you're part of an elite, that wine is this thing that you do in private clubs with gentlemen in ties and you have special kind of glass and all of that and you can only use a corkscrew and the world is not like that. Well, I think it's just going to get bigger and bigger. There's more countries making quality wine. As the wine world expands, which it's doing, uh, there will just be more and more entries. Who would have thought all those years ago it could get up to nearly 20,000 wines? I'd like to see more young people being involved into these competitions because I think we can bring a fresh, different perspective into the judging. When I first started, I remember entering the room and there were a lot of men, men wearing suits, sometimes ties, you know, it was all quite formal. A really great thing about Decanter World Wine Awards is that you have specialist judges, younger judges who are coming through, interested in the category, want to get their head around it, and you see them experiencing that excitement as well. There's so much excitement around new regions, the revival of indigenous varieties, and a real commitment to sustainability and organic production as well, which is really great to see. It's a very exciting uh, moment to be in the wine industry. Yeah.